In fact, that reminds me of some hot GOP on GOP action. Where's that story? As the Times uh, notes today in a front page story, the supposed moderate business wing of the Republican Party, you know, those guys who just want to cut their taxes and defund everything. They were just happy with the sequestration. But now that the uh, Tea Partiers and the full on, not just feigning stupid, but actually stupid, have taken over the Republican Party. Uh, they are claiming they may primary from the, they call it the center right, but it's really, we're just going to primary from the right, from the reactionary right, as opposed to the full-on nativist right, fundamentalist right. Well, Eric Erickson, the one who once uh, claimed that uh, Justice Souter was a goat effer, <laughs> and then subsequently got a job on CNN, if I'm not mistaken. I think he's since moved to Glenn Beck's, uh, where he can really be uh, bat crap crazy. <laughs> Has now posted on uh, Red State <clears throat> that <clears throat> this comes at the same time the Obama administration admits it'll be months before their Obamacare website will be fixed. And Kathleen Sebelius is saying that if people want out of the mandate, they can pay a fine. Nonetheless, Cantor, Bonaire, and with them Mitch McConnell and John Cornyn are expected to cave in and fully fund unimpeded Obamacare. He writes, those leaders will ensure that Obamacare is fully funded and give the American public no delay like businesses have. In doing so, they will see, sow the seeds of a real third-party movement that will fully divide the Republican Party. Boo-hoo would love to see it. Highly doubt it, because even you principled conservatives, you all know where your teat is, and you'll go running back. Eric, son of Eric. <laughs>